Welcome to Job Skill Share. Today I'm making a video for help desk, desktop support, user support technicians, or anyone like that. And if you are a new person who is looking into getting into IT field and you want to start from somewhere, I have a lot of videos that explain stuff, but this is going to be another explanation for people who are new to my channel actually from YouTube, from Google, from anywhere who are actually new, not the people who are already registered because they already know this stuff. So this is going to be people who are just coming in and you just turn on my video right now and you're looking into it and see what the hell is this. So you're gonna find out in a second right now. So basically you went to Google and you typed in um, how to become a help desk or help desk course or um, I w uh, how to start an IT career stuff like that and then somehow you just came here this is what I'm gonna do I'm gonna explain stuff here Joe so it makes it really easy for you guys so you guys are on the track then now if you want to be a help desk person or you want to be a desktop user support or anyone entry level in IT or if you want to get into IT uh, you definitely need basic skills okay so I'm gonna expand that right here and I can explain it so you do need a basic skills for example if I talk about Windows like say if I'm talking to you Windows and I say all of a sudden I say oh this Windows computer is connected to the server so if you knew basic skills or anything uh, a little bit of IT stuff you wouldn't be confused then you wouldn't just stop there and thinking about what what is server what is that term and stuff like that so if I talk about iPad or or maybe some other things like client server technologies uh, virtualizations or maybe I talk about something like virtual box so stuff like that you know live CD ISO and these are the terms now if I talk to, if I talk these terms to a help desk guy or a IT person he I wouldn't stop my conversation with them and we wouldn't be explaining stuff with each other because those are just basic stuff that we need we know um, so if you don't know then you need to have basic skills and basic skills are not covered in this um, platform so there's a very good nice site for basic skills and I put a link in there what I did if you guys go to job skills share and then go to the recent post here is it here it is help desk career path pathway and it's the same thing that I'm discussing right now so basically you have the same chart and on the bottom I have links in there so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on these links and let you know guys so once you click on this link it takes you to this little basic skills training now there's a quiz there are three quizzes if you can do these and they're pretty easy for you you can jump ahead and start uh, learning the help desk course but if you don't you can just quickly scroll down and learn about the basic stuff so let's say for example you want to know about basic computer skills you click on that and it will take you to the jcflearnfree.org great site for learning basic skills everything is free in there so you learn that everything you do if you go back emails google internet basics windows 8 uh, office so a lot of basic stuff you will learn that and it's, it will be really beneficial for you so let's say you're done with that step you think that you're good with that now I want to go ahead and start the real real world stuff I want to learn about the IT stuff now so what do you need to do is you need to register to the site which is basically you need to registration here job skill share is a home to skill sharing basically it's a site where we it's think of this site as a person let's say for example you're you just got hired by a company and there is a professional out there who has been working in the same position for six years so they will basically tell you to go ahead and like you know learn some stuff from him or he will train you so how quickly does he train you You know most of the time we humans we can when we know this is a work we will definitely learn that stuff like in weeks how is that possible you spend so much time in colleges and everything and then when you get out you're so confused you're still you still don't know if it's really gonna help me in the real world so this is what I'm doing right here the platform is made for people who just wants to share their skills and people who wants to learn the skills people who are new to um, any let's say for example someone coming from uh, India or uh, any other country to US and they want to know if they can learn something quickly and then apply for jobs 
um, I didn't find a lot of resources like that so I created this platform so people can help each other out so then they can apply for these jobs and one of the best things about help this is it doesn't require any degree so you could learn the skills from someone and then with your references or try internships and stuff you, you land a job and they pay pretty good money it's about 40 plus or maybe 30 plus so that's a good amount of money to me so I have registration link in here so once you guys go back to the site I'm gonna go back in there and you click on job skill registration you basically need to register here so then it will give you access to the portal which is this portal right here this is the portal where you will see all the courses for IT stuff so help this support into to level and all that stuff but don't that's why I made the pathway so you guys don't get confused with this stuff so I'm gonna go back in there so let's say you did the registration you go back to the links again to that page and then you say okay what is this about now you know the basics everything now you need to get to a real world help this people or uh, uh, technicians they work on ticketing systems even all the IT people work on ticketing systems they know they need to know about this stuff we're talking about ticketing systems like remedy service now a lot of good ones I support there are some big ones like these are all the, the ticketing system that people use and, and in interview people do ask these kind of questions and they, they are very realistic you know now after that when you you're done with ticketing system certificate like I said you have to just go back to the link and once you click on the link it will take you to the once you register first it will take you to this uh, course catalog where you're gonna see these uh, courses and then you can click on it once you click on it you will go into the course finish the course get the certificate of ticketing system then after that I put active directory right here so it's all about user management this is active directory is so important that I can't tell you guys that these days if somebody miss active directory and they just get a plus certifications um, chances are you're not gonna get the job because when they ask you about the Active Directory and you don't know anything about Active Directory it will create some problems for you I'm just gonna give you guys show you guys a little bit a little small example here I'm gonna go to my channel right now and just give you guys a quick or I'll just say job skill share remember I made the whole platform just so that it can help people in real world so it has nothing to do with books or anything like that it's just directly real stuff so this is my channel right here and I'm gonna show you guys a video where Active Directory this is the first video that I made Active Directory but this is not the one it's kinda outdated so I'm gonna go to the new one here this is the new one new basic Active Directory training for ID support right so we have a whole training in this video and now on the bottom just want to show you some some comments so here's a realistic comment here thank you very much for this video this has been a great incredible blah, blah 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 now I can go back to my interview today with more confidence regarding AD I was asked during a phone interview if I had experience with AD and I replied yes now see people are asking uh, another example about job okay this is another example right here thank you just watch your very informative I'm new to AD currently studying for A plus cert it's been hard trying to get an IT job I went on an interview and they asked me and if they asked me if I knew AD I was kind of lost because I didn't know at, at the time so see you don't want to be in this position so you should know Active Directory stuff before you go to interview now this is realistic world right now I'm talking about realistic stuff people are gonna ask you about this stuff so so this is the reason I put it on number four it's very important that you go so I have the link when you go as you go back to the link again so this is the link and when you click on it it will take you to that course catalog again and you can just uh, go to the active directory user management certificate and take that certificate it's a short course with a lot of like five six videos and some projects and then at the end you have helped the support entry level to support course this is a huge course it covers everything from entry to specialist level meaning you will be able to troubleshoot things you will learn about virtualizations 
you'll work these are the terms of virtualization how do we use it uh, as a help desk people I mean entry levels uh, level 2 level 3 or even administrators and then after that there's software installation and it goes to advanced software deployment de what kind of tools you need a lot of tools you, you this is all information uh, anybody can share this information with you guys your goal then because uh, you have uh, you do all the help desk job because of the tools that you use most of the time you do you use a lot of tools to make your job easier so that's the big course right there it covers every single thing and I say that it covers everything from desktop support 1 2 3 help desk analyst 1 2 3 uh, computer support specialist 1 2 3 even IT support uh, for uh, entry level and then after that once you done once you're done with that even with just this platform you got the certificate from ticketing system you got the certificate from active directory and then you got a big certificate from the whole course so once you're done with that I'm pretty sure if you go to indeed.com or dice.com or any other good site for jobs or internships once you go over there and you check the resume out you if you're finished to one two three four five you will be so confident that when you see the resume you think that this is piece of cake I can do this and then you guys can apply and we have people that got jobs so I'm not just making it up here you guys can go back to my the main site right here when you go to jobskillshare.org and just read the comments on the bottom right here how many people have been successful getting landing the jobs right there so this is the main uh, reason behind the job skills share that we're trying to teach real world skills so people can learn the skills quickly so they can apply it either if they got a new job if they are looking for jobs so yeah once you're done with that the seventh is subscribe definitely subscribe to our YouTube channel and like our Facebook page so if you go to the site again over here on the top you guys can just go to Facebook Google YouTube LinkedIn is another important one we just created it and a lot of people are coming to LinkedIn because a lot of of our um, um, jobs or anything related to like a, a professional level they are going to be posted here so hopefully this video was informative video for uh, someone who is new to this uh, who is just looking for this information right now and hopefully this helped you and now you know where to go where to start your career path so you can either start today or tomorrow but if i was you i would start today and finish it off thank you for watching job skills share and see you guys in a different video